Right here is my latest acquisition, just been delivered, Amila S381, I paid just under £128 for this, brand new, which is a good price. This is um, an old uh, shape for Mila. This would now really be considered nearly entry level, I mean the S2s are entry level. Um, these aren't widely available, the S300 series, but uh, since I got the box and the box is the new style of box, it's obviously a cleaner that uh, Mila are going to make available or keep available for a while. And one reason I bought this model, and I hope this cleaner does have the feature, is the ability to use it for blowing. And I'll go into that. A vacuum cleaner, yes, it's always better to suck than blow, but there are occasions when a good blow will help dislodge dirt that even the most powerful suction can't remove. So here we have the machine in a nice deep royal blue. We'll take out the tools first. Pop that to one side and then we'll get the main cleaner out. It's quite standard Miele packaging this one. Two polystyrene ends which will hopefully slide out without breaking. There we go. A bit difficult when you're trying to record. There we are. So here we have the S381. Now there is, I've heard talk that there are some Miele cleaners that are actually manufactured or at least assembled in China. Now, that's not very good. I've just spotted a little, little flaw there. Or perhaps it isn't. Perhaps that's how it should be. Let's have a look on the other side. Oh no, the other side's the same, more or less. So here we have it. Let's just check the rating plate, see if it says it's made in Germany. Um, don't think that banging is a, a dog's tail. I do apologise. It's got Germany on it. Made ah. Oh no, it doesn't. It says Miele and Miele, sorry, and company or something. It's got the Miele address, but it doesn't actually say made in Germany. Oh no, Daisy. I'm sorry about this. Daisy, I haven't time to play. I'm I'm doing I'm doing this video. So you go and amuse yourself, darling. So it might be might be assembled in China, but it first impression seems quite well made. Um, what I like about this model is the built-in tools, which you don't get now. You don't get on the Miele S2, S4, or S6 models. You only get the built-in tools now on the S5 and the new S8. Yes, Daisy May. Would you please leave? So, here we have the machine and I can see that it looks like it is suitable for blowing because there is a blowing outlet, which I'll demonstrate later on. So we have the three standard Miele tools, the upholstery brush, a very small crevice tool, and this is the very basic dusting brush with a swivel, you can turn that swivel it, but it's got synthetic bristles which are quite harsh I find them to be so there's that bag check indicator that's a nice action let's see inside so it takes FJM bags with the red collar and like all Miele's now the bag collar is colour coordinated with the um, receiving Dubri and it says M so there's no confusion as long as your bag says M on it or if you buy genuine Miele bags and they've got a red collar they'll fit this machine two filters there's a motor protection filter 
It's quite stiff. Ooh, you normally get um, one of those with the new packer bags. And the most basic of Miele's filters, the Air Clean. And looking at that, I'm not sure if it can be up, it might be upgradable um, to a HEPA or active air clean. If that bit comes off, I'll check the instructions and put, the, put that back. Oops, a bit of a cracking noise. So there's the unit itself. So we'll have a look in the box of bags. Box of bags, I mean the uh, box, you know. You know what I mean. Not the box of bags, the box of tools is what I'm trying to say. Right. We have a Miele hose. The familiar curved hand grip. The end there. Telescopic extension tube. I used to have this model um, in a Bahama blue colour, lighter blue, and it has a two piece tube. Um, but it's better that this model has the telescopic tube. And we've got bog standard here, head. Quite a compact head, looks a bit smaller than the one you get with the S5, but at least it's got a nice metal base plate and there's the litter pickers there. And there's brush at the front and a squeegee at the back, so when you put it into hard floor, the squeegee comes out to prevent any particles flicking out back out. And then there's a brush at the front and side suction channels. So I'd say that's not the most basic Miele head because the S2 model has a more basic head than that that's all plastic. But it's, compared to a lot of vacuums you buy, it's a pretty good head. And we all like good head from time to time. And now here's the operating instructions, model S360, S388. So that's the Miele S381 I've just purchased. From Very, it's one of the few places I've seen it. Now Very are part of Shop Direct Group and you'll see other catalogue names under the Shop Direct banner. Um, there's Kay's, Littlewoods, um, Ismi, there's probably others. Now if you, if you compare Very with Littlewoods you'll find that they sell more or less exactly the same things but the prices are different but Littlewoods offer um, free delivery and interest free credit. Well they say it's interest free but the prices of the goods are higher. So although you can, you can pay on a weekly and a monthly basis and not pay any more than the catalogue price, the catalogue price is inflated to, um, to incorporate that so called free credit. But very the prices are less, but you do pay for the credit unless you, you can actually spread the payments over three months interest free. And what I do um, with very, if you spend a certain amount, you can buy now, pay in nine or twelve, well I think it's six, nine or twelve months later, depending on how much you spend. My order came to just over 200 with some other bits I bought. So I was given the option of nine months interest free credit which I've taken them up on. As long as you pay for it within the nine months, there's no interest added. As long as you do pay for it. Because if you don't, they will put a lot of interest on before you even start paying. Now, back to the machine. Here's very basic foot operated on off switch, foot operated cord, rewind. Obviously a nice tough fitted plug. That's a UK plug for you overseas Viewers with a three pin and there's a fuse, replaceable fuse inside. And let's see, rewind action there. So that's the machine. What I'm going to do now is have a look uh, to see if it will actually take the blowing adapter that I've brought with me. So um, I'll see you in a bit with a little bit of a demonstration. 
of the Miele S381. Thank you, Daisy.